A very welcome to you. We are here with 17th of June's quality blessing. Realization is such a power that it makes you feel either powerful or it makes you feel weaker, provided you are right or wrong. And if you are soul conscious, if you are atma conscious, then most of the things which you are doing in your life are righteous and that's why you don't need to be fearful of anything. And that's what God is trying to tell us today in this beautiful blessing. Let's read his words in God's words. May you have realization and from being weak become powerful as an master almighty authority. God is almighty authority and we are his children so we become master almighty authority. The humanity of a human life depends on the soul, the kind of soul. If a soul is pure soul, everything goes well. Karmas are good, everybody around them becomes happy. If a soul is an impure soul with lust, anger, greed, ego, attachment, automatically the whole humanity suffers. So God says, what type of a soul am I? Am I a pure soul or am I an impure soul? What am I? When you have this realization, you are then able to have peace as your original religion. So peace is our oral, original religion. It's not that we are Hindu, Muslim, Sikh. Like that doesn't define us. Peace defines us. Joy defines us. Happiness defines us. What kind of a religious person am I? If I am if I'm angry, so I'm showing or showcasing that my religion is teaching me anger. Is it? No. But if I am being peaceful, then my religion is teaching me peace. Then God says, the realization of being an elevated soul, a child of almighty authority, that I am an elevated soul, I am a creation of God, I am a child of God, he is creating my mind and my intelligence, he is reforming or recreating my mind and intelligence in a pure form, makes you powerful from weak. Just this realization, such a powerful soul and a master almighty authority soul can do in a practical way whatever he wants and however he wants. Such a powerful soul and a master almighty authority soul can do in a practical way whatever he wants, that means you want, and however he wants. Imagine this power where you are able to steer off the troubles, you are able to guide people to towards righteousness, towards seeing the right things in life and you are benevolent, you are somebody who is powerful, peaceful first within and you are able to spread peace and righteousness all around you. You are able to make people see the truth. So that is what God is talking about, the realization and that's what we